Good evening, I'm Juhi Rajput and you're watching Emerging SME, a TV program which highlights the achievement of such SMEs who from a modest beginning have now become a brand name in their respective business verticals. Our first story in today's episode is on Global Stones Private Limited, which brings to the world a wide range of stones and is a leading mining and processing unit of rough granite, marble and soft quartzite. Director of the company, Mr. Mayank Shah, is responsible for turning around Global Stones from a second closed unit to a profitable and world-renowned organization. Our correspondent, Deeksha Yadav, caught up earlier with him in his Jaipur office. Have a look at this remarkable journey. Today, Global Stones Private Limited is the leading mining and processing unit of rough granite, marble and soft quartzite in India. How you have been able to turn around a sick and close unit to a profitable and world-renowned organization. In the year 2004, when we acquired this unit, the granite industry in North India was dying and there was very little scope. We were challenged by the nose of the industry that we'll have to pack our bags in six months and leave. It was a do or die situation for me. The resources which we had were very limited, the machinery was very outdated, the manpower was totally demotivated. So it was, it was a very big task to revive the unit. Revival of the industry was my only option. So for this, the first thing which I did was to make my plant operational, have the infrastructure all set. After this, we got, we, uh, you know, tried to make extensive uh, trips to the US to bring to the world our products. And we realized that, you know, there was not much demand for the products. So we started doing new explorations, looking for new avenues, new products, new patterns. And over the years, with the, with the help of God's grace, you know, we have been, and the efforts of our team, we've been able to revive the industry and turn it into a profitable organization. Global Stones Private Limited is committed to quality and has been building a family of satisfied customers. Please tell us about the infrastructure and processing facilities that enables you to produce world-class quality products. In 2004, when we acquired the unit, the unit had very basic infrastructure. The machines were outdated and there was very less which we could do in terms of giving a good product to our customers. So in the year 2014, we decided to revamp our unit totally and we added the new Breton multi-wire which was first of its kind in the country. We, you know, it helps us uh, to give us uh, production in a much faster way and better quality. We also added the uh, polishing line from Breton which is uh, the best in the industry. Apart from this, we added the resin line, which helps us uh, to get better filling and better coverage of the air slab surfaces. So, you know, by doing this, uh, we can ensure uh, that uh, the customers uh, who get our products get nothing but the best. To make sure that our customers get the best product, uh, the most important thing for our industry is the raw material. So me, along with my team, handpick the blocks from the quarries and once the blocks are there in the factory, the inspection, there is an inspection team at every single point which makes sure that uh, the quality is taken care and ultimately the product which our client receives is nothing but the best. Which are the major world renowned projects you take pride of being associated with? Okay, we've been, we've had the honor of uh, getting associated with a lot of projects worldwide. And uh, some of them uh, we are associated with them directly and some we are associated with indirectly because uh, we work through the distribution channel. And uh, so we have supplied to the Dubai International uh, Terminal 3. Apart from that, we've been associated with uh, the Jabber Palace. Now this is the uh, driveway, I mean this is the palace to the king in, in Dubai. And uh, they did a center portico which was actually the main driveway to the uh, king's palace and uh, we supplied a lot of uh, granite for uh, that purpose. Apart from that, uh, we have uh, supplied to various uh, hotels in the US, uh, the Hilton chains. Apart from this, uh, we have uh, supplied to various uh, distributors in US, 
uh, who have uh, you know given the materials to various housing projects hotel projects and we are also doing something for uh, the domestic t3 in uh, delhi global stone is a star export house and has received several awards for export promotion please tell us about the major industry recognition received in the recent past so we've been receiving export awards uh, starting from 2005 uh, from uh, Capaxil, which is uh, the body which gives us uh, the awards in our sector. Uh, in the recent years, we received uh, the award for uh, you know revival of the dyeing granite industry in North India, which was a very prominent award uh, as it recognized whatever uh, good deeds we have done in these years. Apart from this, we have received uh, the award for uh, the 100 uh, SME companies in India, top 100 SME companies in India. We also received the award for uh, the fastest industrial growth and uh, we have also received uh, the award for uh, the special export award uh, by Capaxil again. How has been the financial result in last two years and what growth prospect you see in the upcoming years? See, it's a very progressive industry and uh, the building we are directly associated with the building uh, community in the united states because that's one of the major markets for us for our products and uh, in the last few years uh, the us market has been on increasing increasing trends the growth has been good so uh, as in our company is concerned uh, in the last two years we've had a good growth uh, especially last year where we have uh, we've had a nearly a growth percentage of 50% uh, that's mainly because of uh, you know the machineries and uh, the uh, things which we have changed in our company. Uh, going forward, uh, you know there is a lot of trend which has moved towards from the natural industry to uh, the artificial engineered stone. So we are setting up a state of the art plant uh, in the SEZ zone uh, in Jaipur, uh, which is to do with engineered stone. So, uh, you know, in the next few years, uh, as in uh, our company is concerned, we look at a growth of uh, nearly 100%. Lastly, Mr. Shah, I would like to ask you, Global Stones is North India's leading producer and exporter of natural stone. So what is vision for the future of your company? See, as I mentioned, uh, you know, uh, the vision for our company will be uh, exploring new products, new colors, new patterns so that uh, you know our clients never feel disappointed that they are buying the same old thing again and again so we are also looking enhancing capacity at, at our existing plant uh, which by which you know we can uh, cater to our client needs in a better manner so that was global stones which is striving to be one of the world's largest and best exporter and processor of granites marble soft quartzite soap stones and other indian natural stones here we'll take a short break, lot more on the other side. Stay tuned.